Hello and welcome to City Skylines with Burrito. In today's episode, we're going to try some scenarios out. Uh, the first one is the, uh, the green power scenario. This shouldn't be too hard. With the recent advances in energy production, using only renewable energy sources is not only viable, but only an environmentally conscious choice. Make the city that runs only with green power and prove the naysayers wrong. We could do this. All right, so let's uh, start off by just pretty much joining the city into the uh, highway, and then we'll get started building the city. So let's uh, enjoy this little speedy building clip, and we'll be right back. Okay, so we have to finish up, pretty much zoning up this last section here, and we're good to start actually running the city all the way through. And let's see how fast we can beat this thing out. I think we can be able to beat this challenge pretty easily. I mean, I, I usually use renewable resources when I build. And what the? How the heck did I lose the scenario? All right, forget that one. We're gonna start over. We're gonna do the by the dam. So all we got to do is just reach a population of 6,000 or 65,000. How hard can that be? That's a nice little city by the dam. Let's hope nothing bad happens to it. Dot, dot, dot. So, this, so far this night view is amazing. Just look at the northern lights. Look at the city lights. But that's amazing itself. But these northern lights are just fantastic. I like this map. So, I pretty much built up the city a little bit. And hopefully we'll be able to start having some growth here. I put a second dam here so I can uh, get a little bit extra power. Hopefully that's not working here soon because it's the water in. That way, you know, Keep up with the water demand. Alright, I see I put some houses here on top of the hill. I've also installed a key in the lower section. That way some of these houses and businesses don't get flooded out. But I want to get a, another square here. I think we're going to get to this top square here to expand a little bit. There's a little bit of or mineral on this top map here that I checked out that I want to get into. Yeah, we're starting to have some expansion here. See that real river back there actually goes all the way over here also. So that's kind of cool. We're like a little island in the middle. Anyway, let's zone out this ore and get that all finished up. Alright, let's make a square about right here. That way we can do an exit ramp for this highway and wait what did I say a meteor I got a meteor coming in are you serious there's disasters on this thing oh let me put a freaking shelter in place I didn't think it was gonna be disasters um, right here looks like a good spot all right so I can tell these guys to evacuate and work it okay they just hit where did they hit I don't know where it hit at but it had to be somewhere up there by that water because there is a wave tsunami flooding out my entire city there's no power because the dam stopped working and okay the power's back on but this wave is decimating the entire city it's following that river and this is nuts and I just fixed that oh I'm so glad I did that I wouldn't ask him to help out but this, this town is decimated except for the highland areas 
Those guys are sitting pretty up there on the mountain, but the lowlands, everything is wiped out. Wow. Jeez. That's going to set me back. A bankruptcy alert. Oh, wow. All right, so I'm going to take out this bailout. All right, I'm going to buy this lower square here so I can fix that issue that we had right there. That triangle, it just, it just slowed everything down. So I, hopefully we're leveling this off. That's going to fix this issue. Widening that out. Yeah, make it look more natural. Looks good, looks good. Okay. All right, let's let that water flow out. And I was just letting the water flow out, and I'm getting hit by another. What am I in the freaking asteroid belt? All right, let's got this in place. So let's tell these guys to go ahead and evacuate. And let's see if we can see where the impact is going to be. All right, right there, right on top. We saw it. We got it on video this time. Oh, man, that wave is going to knock everything out. I don't have one of these. Let me place this down. This is the, uh, the pretty much the fixing office, the disaster headquarters thing. Yeah, this is gonna. Yeah, we're just gonna help us out. We're gonna give us some power, some water. Okay. Okay. Everything's been averted. Everything's just been a while since I recorded that last clip. I'm gonna put in a cargo hub here for this uh, little ore industry that I got going on here. And, also, I'm going to do a forestry industry, too. I think that's going to be helping out some of these things. I mean, I don't know. I guess I'm going to line it across here. I have two bridges. It's kind of weird, but eh, it works. It is what it is. And I guess I can do a little loop here. I mean, if they want to go the other way, go back the way they came. So is that going to look out good? It's all connected. It's connected. Yeah, I don't see anything wrong with that. Yeah, that should be cool. All right, so now we got a little cargo here. We're going to get this thing some water and electricity so that's oh that's easy water's right there as far as electricity as far as that's this far all right perfect that works okay so hopefully this is going to help us grow the city so we can expand we have twelve thousand people okay we finally got the crematoriums they're in place we're going to put these down also to the city this is going to help us with these death waves that we can constantly are getting let's do some expansion that forestry area put in. Be nice and little. Uh, I don't have to be on the forestry area, but there's a natural area down here. Separate that, make it look nice in these districts. Yeah, geez, just want to line them straight. Right, one more of those districts up here. Tidy those up right down the middle, through the streets. Oh, this is probably so much easier on a computer with a mouse. Big section here, these three little spots. Oh yeah, it's gonna look good. Put a bunch of trees in here. A huge forest area, a little residential area in the trees. Oh, this is gonna be so nice. Get some water in there. Make sure they're good to go. Perfect. Upgrade these up to the water treatment plants. That way the water is gone so it's polluted. Okay. Just gotta hug these guys up. Get some more power. I think we're going to be good to expand on these two areas here. The nice industry, the forestry industry we're going to put in. Some residential. Some local produce for the farm district next door. Yep, there we go. We're getting bigger. We're going good. I think we're just going to, going to might one of the better cities right here. We're going to complete this one. No problem. This scenario is going to be cake. Wait, it's never lost. How did I lose? Oh my god, 300 game weeks have passed in the game. Are you kidding me? You know, that's the second scenario in this episode that I've lost. Are you kidding me? I can't even pass a simple scenario. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I do appreciate it. Like the video. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And we'll see you guys on the next episode of City Skylines with burrito.